everyone welcome back to my channel let me shut this door because of course my television is on and I don't want that to be too disturbing but today um, I'm doing a follow-up of my life or what's been going on with Mika um, actually as many of you know the people that follow my current videos um, I am a new nurse graduate um, I've graduated from school back in September. I am working in the field now, so I'm very, very busy um, and don't have too much time but to eat and sleep. But po uh, pre me getting a job, I uh, took a much needed trip after school to Las Vegas. That was one of my graduation gifts. So. Um, me and a couple of my girlfriends went to Las Vegas and it was pretty much all three of our first time I'm going to Las Vegas and it was during quarantine. I mean, not sorry, not quarantine, but during the pandemic. So we didn't get to really do Las Vegas, you know, for, for all that it's worth, but I still enjoyed myself. I did actually pick up a item while there. That I was looking for here in the States. Um, well, actually not in the state that I live in, but I, I always buy pretty much my collection from Falls Church, Virginia at the Tyson's Corner location. Um, I adore that mall. I adore the essay that I work with frequently. But for this item, I wanted to pick something up on vacation to say, oh, I got this piece from Las Vegas. If that makes any sense to you, maybe not. But to me, it does. So let's see what it is. Comes in this box here. Comes in this dust bag here. It's not too big. So, it is the Louis Vuitton belt. See the buckle? I believe this is the 28. Let me see if I have the information in here. Let's look at the tag. Okay, it doesn't have what I'm trying to point out to you, but I don't believe this, this is not even the tag for this. This is $1,190. This was for my pochette. So this is not the tag. This retail, I believe I purchased this for Four hundred and I don't know if it was thirty dollars or four hundred and fifty dollars, but I did pick it up from the Las Vegas uh, Louis Vuitton while I was there. Um, I've been eyeing it for a few weeks before I went to Vegas. I didn't know if I wanted to, um, like I said, purchase it in Virginia or get it when I went on vacation, and I decided to purchase it while on vacation. So this is my Vegas piece. I'm very happy with it, even though I have not worn it just yet. That's one piece that I picked up from Las Vegas. Actually, this was the only luxury item I picked up. I'm happy with my choice. Can't wear it, can't really go anywhere in the pandemic. So, um, a few, This is one item I received back right before I left for my trip. This was my all time favorite. It's the four key pouch holder and this beautiful orange interior. What happened was um, these rings I had to have replaced because this part, the whole part that holds the, the rings came off. So I had to have this replaced. The replacement was, um, I want to say, if I'm not mistaken, I believe it was $60 to replace. But in the meantime, when this was broke, I did purchase the six key ring. Because I was deciding if I was going to get this one fixed or not. 
but I end up doing it because I love this key pouch. But um, as you can see in comparison, let me hold this up. In comparison, the two, this holds much more. And at this time, I'm gonna open this up because this has a lot of different uh, added keys now because since this one I've moved, so now I have um, my, G my gem key fob, my new house keys, I have a few, I have my Wise discount card, I have my um, keychain there, and I have two sets of mailbox keys because I'm currently still holding the keys to my son's apartment um, and his his house key as well. So, so every now and then I go down and check on them. So it's pretty much full. So I decided to just keep using my Six ring key holder okay. and then also this is an old piece that I haven't carried in a while it's the uh, I was about to say clay but it's not the clay it's the mini pochette I have some old papers in there I haven't carried this since I got my wallet back that was stole from my friend's car so I haven't carried this since I got my wallet, but this was my all-time go-to piece to carry all my cards, lip glosses. So that's that here. Also, um, I did manage to get the uh, coin purse, which I left in my car, so I can't show that to you guys at this time. Um, I believe I did show and do a video on my Bandelay, but if not, I can go and grab that for you guys. One moment. Okay, this is my Bandelay here that I picked up many, many months ago. Um, I wore it a few times. It's reversible. It's cream and brown on one side and it's a black bag collection on the other side. So that's pretty much all I have to show today. Um, thank you for watching. So of course subscribe, like if you do so. Thank you and have a nice day.